We've all heard that AI uses a tremendous amount of energy and that it produces a tremendous amount of carbon emissions as a result. But how much energy exactly? What happens when we query an AI chatbot or generate a video? And what happens as those queries pile up? To find out, let's start at the bottom and look at the impact of an individual prompt. Then we can work all the way up to a nationwide network of data centers. Companies like Google and OpenAI keep energy usage figures closely guarded. But by looking at open source models, we can make some informed estimates. Asking a simple question to a small AI model might use the same amount of electricity as running a microwave for eight seconds, not even long enough to reheat last night's dinner. But larger text models can use more energy than AI models that generate images. Video queries can be the most energy intensive of all. Creating a five second video with AI might use enough electricity to run a microwave for over an hour. But the high definition videos that you've seen from leading AI companies likely use much more energy than that. Now let's look at what happens when you put everyone's individual queries together. OpenAI has said that ChatGPT receives about 2.5 billion queries each day. All of the responses to those queries are generated in a data center. And data centers are often powered by particularly dirty forms of energy, like natural gas and coal. Over the course of a year, 2.5 billion daily queries could emit the same amount of carbon as driving more than 280 million miles in a gas-powered vehicle. That's enough to circumnavigate the globe over 11,000 times. Experts predict that in 2028, the electricity being used to power AI could generate the same emissions as driving over 300 billion miles, over 1,600 round trips to the sun from Earth. AI is emerging not just as a technology, but as its own sector with a growing carbon footprint. So where is all this going? Where's that energy going to come from and who's going to pay for it? What will it mean for our planet? To learn more, go to technologyreview.com slash energy dash AI.